nombre es Sebastián Bolaños, tengo 39 años, esta es mi casa y muchos de los valores que ustedes ven acá son los que me representan día a día. The scene in the city, you have people honking, you got people throwing cars on each other. Uh, the rat race is just going out of hand. The, the real jungle is completely different than the concrete jungle. Sounds are completely opposite. We'll come back to this part of town because the vibe, how do people react, how do people act around you. Even when you're at the real jungle here, you go out and people will actually say good morning even though they're having a bad day. It's cleaner, it's nicer. It gives you an energy that, uh, that you might enjoy in a way that will get you on a, on a different mood. In a way or another, you have to find the time to disconnect. And if you can disconnect, going from one place to another, going from the gray to the green. I think that would something that I would start suggesting to myself. Sometimes when I tell people that, well, actually I haven't told people that we do that. Well, you do it on Instagram. Oh, you, ha you, you, you checked me out on Instagram, did you? <laughs> when I tell people that we have planted over 50,000 trees, they just laugh. Uh, the thing is that they don't know that the importance of that. One of the first things you see when you leave the city are the trees. You come back here and you start seeing such a diversity of, of greens, high trees, low trees, that it's so magical how the leaves of a lot of them differ so much. This forest is older than us. It's seen more than, than we've seen. So they actually know more than we know. Caring for this place that has allowed me to do what I love the most is uh, one of the most beautiful feelings in the world. All right, it's time to go. <laughs> In a way or another, uh, when I ride my bike and I enjoy the landscape, uh, I feel like I'm also giving back to it. Riding my bike is just the biggest expression of freedom, I would say. When you feel the, the breeze in your face, when you feel every single crack of the road in your hands, it's something that has no explanation and only the people that have ridden can endure that, can feel it. I, I, I ride my bike because it's just uh, what inspires me to go to bed earlier, get up earlier. In a way, it helps me out with my day-to-day -day work to, to have a clearer head. Whenever you're suffering on top of a bike, it's actually growing on your mind because you're finding ways on, on doing things different.